Hi everybody, this is Kwame Mall here, and today I'm gonna show, I'm gonna do a tutorial on uh, the fix for Vegas. Uh, by that, I let me just show you the problem real quick. So here, I just open up Vegas, and it gets stuck at initializing GPUX or video processing over here, and it gives me this uh, problem report. So now, if I go down to show problem details, it gives me this description. So here, what it uh, okay, this isn't the usual error that I have. This is something different, but who cares? Okay, okay, no, here, here it is. This is the usual error that I get. So I'm pretty sure most of the people who have AM an AMD uh, GPU or an AMD graphics card would have this exception error. So um, now I'm going to show you a fix for it. Okay, so. You can just close this, uh, like do not send or something. Okay, uh, you're back at your desktop. So uh, the fix for this is uh, AMD Catalyst Control Center. So you just need that uh, suite, or you can just download it. Link would be given in the description below. Or should I search for it quickly? No. Okay. So AMD Catalyst. Yep, here it is. Catalyst Control Center. You can do. You can just type that if you have Windows 10 like that or you can if you have Windows 8 also I think you should just like click on the Windows button over here or on your keyboard and then just type in so over here under power you have to go to switchable graphics application settings this takes us thing okay yeah so here it is so this is where uh, actually this isn't actually the main problem if you really want a GPU accelerated video processing uh, this uh, like if then this would be the fix but if you don't want it and you have no idea why this is coming and you don't have any idea why this is like happening now I'll just show you that like I'll just show you how to fix that in a minute so from power saving which uh, if I switch this to high performance or based on power source but since my laptop is currently charging uh, so based on power source would mean it would be on high performance but just for now I'm putting this on high performance uh, usually I guess uh, I usually keep it on power saving because I personally don't prefer um, GP accelerated video processing but just for this I'm gonna quick show you guys that now it's gonna work it is gonna work it's gonna work now any moment yep it's working it it passed it initializing GPX accelerator video processing and look here we've here we've got Sony Vegas Pro 13.0 I guess this is the pro version yeah this is the pro version I just said it we've got you can do stuff uh, now as I was earlier I said that if you don't want the GPU accelerator video processing, what you have to do is go to Options, Preferences, Video, and over here you have GPU acceleration of video processing. Right now I have Advanced Micro Devices, which is AMD. I also have an Intel, uh, not exactly a graphics card, but I don't know what what's going wrong with this. Maybe it's because my processor is Intel, but uh, anyways, that doesn't matter. So you can just uh, put it to off like that so but still even to go to to reach this 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 part you would have to you would still need the catalyst control center to put this on high performance and if if you want well I have to restart Vegas just to show you guys how that works so what I'm gonna do now is since I switched it off I'm gonna put my graphics thing back to power saving click on apply and search for Vegas Vegas Pro 13 ah, stupid stupid thing and well see it still it, it went past that and yep here we are and uh, just to double check let me just show you I went to preferences video GPU acceleration of video processing is currently off that's how it is even if I go cancel it will still be off okay so yeah, as I was saying, even if you want to reach this step of uh, turning it off, you would. St I think by default it's on, but if even if you want to like turn it off, you would still need the Catalyst Control Center. But so after you're done with this fix, uh, you could uninstall it. But 
I would I would say uh, keep it because sometimes it's really good like what if you just want GPX over processing for some time or uh, if you're a laptop this is like really gonna be it's gonna be like really useful so something like um, you could just go to all the applications and stuff like that and you can just like uh, so right now Vegas Pro is on power saving so let's say I have this game called Sanctum which is on high performance I just did that some time ago so and this high performance uh, you can make this based on power saving and something like that just to save some power temporarily and uh, yeah so that's all about the fix so actually it's a two step process really easy might want to put in the three step to just to, uh, uh, install the catalyst control center but it's really you guys that that's all that's just it it's just two steps to get back to video editing so uh now you guys might be wondering uh if you're an nvidia user and you still have some problems with this graphics uh, this gpu accelerated video processing so even if you have an intel or an nvidia graphics card or driver adapter or something uh, there are still many steps that you can do to uh, you know to fix it but obviously this step wouldn't be it uh, if at all you have if you could like just switch like get it to work even once just somehow you could just quickly go to your preferences and the first thing you do is just disable it over here if you're not using it then uh, like this happened to me once or twice like uh, for like it wasn't working for some time but then uh, about a week ago I guess then later on it started working just magically and then for like the last two three days it's just been like this and then I just found a fix for it okay and um, okay so yeah so for the Nvidia users you can update your drivers you can obviously try to uh, go to your device manage this device the device manager over here just by right clicking on this windows uh, uh, applicate uh, this whatever windows just right click on it and go to device manager if you're on windows 7 I don't know how you do it I'm sorry display adapters so Intel AMD just right click and say update driver software or something like that uh, then what else uh, you can uninstall and reinstall Vegas you can reinstall your drivers you can just forget about Vegas Pro for the rest of your life unless you're in the middle of editing some kind of project or whatever you were doing then you probably shouldn't forget about it uh, maybe yeah I guess or just I don't know okay I guess I guess that's the only that's the only way that's the only thing you can do or just restart your computer did you like ever try doing that like It'll be funny if you just restart your computer and then this whole thing works because then this entire 10 minute video would just go for a waste. But okay, I'm just going to end this video so it doesn't really take 10 minutes, it's going to take a max of about 9 minutes. So, okay, if you guys like this video, hit the like button. If you want to watch more of my videos, please subscribe to my channel, it's called more. I play loads of other games just like you saw Sanctum and stuff like that. Okay, but let me just show you. Yeah, I got Blue Stacks, True of Drobocraft. Blue Stacks not a game, I know. Uh, Fistful of Frags, Blockade, Tungo, which is not a game again, I know. Call of Duty, World at War, Unturned, Steam, which is not a game at all. I Am Bread, Fortress 2, Team Fortress 2, sorry. Uh, Batman Origins, and there are tons of, tons of, ton, tons of, tons of other games, yeah, tons of other games that I play, which you guys can check it out. And if you have any, any questions regarding this tutorial or anything, just like, Put in the link below and I will check it out and try to reply as fast as possible. But till then, thanks for watching and bye.